Let's take a question from Mario asking, do you think Ukraine actually has a shot at this? Um, I'm assuming <laughs> you mean success in the ongoing war. Um, additional aid has already been passed in several countries that will be delivered soon, and the Ukrainians seem to still be pushing back the Russian army. It's yeah, I mean, very complicated mm -hmm. because I think even if there is a ceasefire, I, I honestly believe that Russia will try again, maybe in a few years, maybe in a few decades. I think they will try again. I don't know. And for this yeah, immediate I, conflict, what do you think, Armin? Okay, it depends on what you mean by having a shot. Having a shot at, like, not losing Kiev, it seems like they do very much, right? Um, but, I mean, I'm not, but having a shot at what? Not losing the eastern part of Ukraine? That's more questionable, right? Like, you know, Donbass region and all of that. Like, could Putin take that? Um, I mean, it seems okay. So, it seems like they might have a slight shot at being able to take that back, but not a very high chance. But the fact that they even have a chance is unbelievable because we didn't think they ha they would have a chance. Like we would think. Like, I don't know, like a month ago, we would think that, yeah, they, they're going to lose that part for sure, right? But the fact that that is questionable right now is unbelievable. Like, we're talking about Ukraine. One, it's a very poor country going against the second largest army in the world. And now we're questioning whether or not they are able to take back <laughs> all of Ukraine, except Crimea, maybe, right? So... Yeah, I mean, they have a shot, a low shot, but the fact that it, that's even possible is amazing. What do you think? Yeah, I, I, I agree. I think what really complicates this situation is, okay, so even if Russia does um, take portions of the country or all of the country, um, they still have to deal with the dynamic between being an occupier and local insurgents and i saw somewhere um that analysts have determined that for every insurgent you need like 30 occupying soldiers well <laughs> the ukrainians have millions of people and they have proven themselves to be fierce so i can only imagine the money that russia would have to sink into ukraine to sustain an occupying force there not to mention the fact that it's also complicated by the fact that these are neighboring countries, right? It, whereas when the U.S. goes in somewhere on the other side of the world, like they have to go home eventually to the other side of the world. But it, it kind of similar to Iran and Iraq, like those are neighbors. They have to continue to deal with each other. They have to continue to deal with the prospect of more interference indefinitely. Um, so that makes it quite complicated. Like even if Russia completely pulls out, like they're, they're still in the same neighborhood. That that yeah. problem isn't going away altogether. And I firmly believe that they will try again. But, and not yeah, only will they try I, again, they'll push harder. I think they'll push into Moldova, Transnistria, Transnistria maybe Poland. Yeah, but how could they? Like now they're going to, now Ukraine will be more ready. There are more countries united with Ukraine. And Russia will be weaker. Ukraine will be like the relative power is going to only shift more in favor of you. Like even if they succeed in holding. OK, so a month ago we were saying that, OK, yeah, Putin is going to take over all of, all of Ukraine. But this will be so devastating to them because it's going to be hard for them. It's going to be easy for them to take Ukraine, but it's going to be difficult for them to hold Ukraine, just like it was e difficult for uh, United States to hold Af it was easy for them to take Afghanistan, but it was hold difficult for them to hold Afghanistan exactly. or hold Iraq, right? But Russia can't even hold, uh, can't even take Ukraine, let alone hold it. So let's say, okay, they come back a couple of years and they manage to do take the things that they want to take. It's only going to make it worse for them if they if they're successful. They're actually going to be more devastating to russia than they're not i mean maybe this was maybe it was good okay so it was it's bad for putin but it's good for russia that they failed it would be devastating if they succeeded holding it would have been very destructive to russia so yeah, that's yeah what I'm i mean saying. 
Yeah, yeah, exactly. So I don't know. It's it's I, it's imagine, all a mess. <laughs> I mean, I wonder if like all of this makes you know how eventually the Soviet Union fell. Part of it was like had to do with them trying to hold Afghanistan and not being mm -hmm. able to do that, right? Mm -hmm. So now imagine if this makes this regime also. I'm not saying that will happen. Okay, I know it's very unlikely. Okay, but if imagine if this if this regime also falls because of Ukraine, right? Then then the narrative yeah. like imagine, the David Goliath story would be like Russia tried to take down Ukraine, but <laughs> Russia, the superpower. Russia fell <laughs> fell to its of, knees <laughs> because of you because of the little country that could and the little country yeah. that stood up. <laughs> oh my yeah. god! Yeah, uh, you know what the the situation in Ukraine for the Russian reminds me of. I think it's a World War II acronym. The acronym is FUBAR, which stands for effed up beyond all recognition. <laughs> So like kind of what you're saying, like if they win, they lose. Like this whole situation is effed up beyond all recognition. Hey guys, if you're a fan of blasphemy and sexy Callie, you know, like me, then you need to be sure to subscribe to our newsletter. Link in the description below. Because if you subscribe, we will send you a free copy of our Blasphemous Art ebook. And let me tell you, it is the tastiest blasphemy that you can find anywhere available today and we are so generous with our blasphemy that we continue to send you more blasphemy every week so make sure to subscribe link in the description below